Get your votes in, guys. So Mr. Braps thinks that this song is saying. Have you done? Have you got the lyrics up? Well, we'll play it. No, no. Play we'll it first. Play yeah. It, yeah. Um, so he's been singing this song, thinking it's. I thought she was an Indian, but I think it's saying I thought she was in Indiana. Yeah. Play that. Indiana. Comes up again. Ready? Indian. Indiana. Right. So lyrics. Get the lyrics up. Yeah, Indian. No, it's not. Yes. No, it's not. It says Indian right there. I thought she was an Indian. I thought she was an Indian. Simeon. What Simeon mean? Go, Mr. Braps was right. She cooks up another obstacle. <laughs> <laughs> she was back home. I don't oh, know the tribe or the phone. No, we're not right. We're just taking pictures. So I have a story to tell. It's like an unboxing video. What do you think's in the bag? I actually don't know. I've just realised I've got no idea what you're doing. I reckon it's be a massive dildo. <laughs> I wish. So when I was young, actually, let's start off with what happened the other day. So there I am in the kitchen, chilling, doing what I'm doing, karate moves. And uh, I turn around and I notice that a GoPro mount is just perfectly like balanced in this one right here. How's the view? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, about it. Hold on, let me get some crumbs off. Anyway, I turn around after doing my karate moves and I see a, a GoPro mount balanced perfectly like this, like my finger is. Look. Pretty, isn't it? Perfectly balanced. As all things should be. So I've had to be like so careful because when I was younger, I had a phobia of toasters or fear of them. Um, anyway, I've approached it as I've gone to grab it. I've approached it so careful. Now I know that if I miss it, it's going to drop. And I've gone to grab it and I've got it and it's dropped straight in there. So now the toaster's unusable because I won't risk my life like that. So today we brought the toaster to the strip and a football. And our mission is to get the GoPro mount out of the toaster. But um, pretty much if you want to know the story of me and my toasters. When I was younger I had a babysitter and um, she's babysitting me. And I was cooking crumpets I remember so clearly. The crumpets were ready but they popped up. And they went back down and then i took a knife and then the knife had a plastic handle luckily and i've gone to get the crumpets out and then as i'm looking in here i saw all the red lines from inside the toaster like where the heat comes from and my curiosity has took the best of me and i was thinking what happens if i touch the red bits with the knife if you put one fin on that boat are you listening to me don't touch the boat and I've got closer and closer and I touched it. Boom! All the electric in the house turned off other than like the upstairs TV. Yeah. And then the babysitter was like, what the f was that? And yeah, I could have died. And then I put a spoon in the microwave. So here we have the toaster mounted up. New mod. I'm taking for a little test run. Should I get on the bike? Is it holding up? What? Sitting on the back, facing backwards? No, no, I mean on mine. Oh yeah, yeah, do that. <laughs> Let's have a look at it. Let's have a look at it. She survived. Pretty good toaster. That was a pretty good toaster. That was scary though. Oh, was it? Like every time you slow down, the, the toaster came closer to your wheel. Let's have a look. I fixed it. The GoPro mount's out of there. Yeah, I might actually take this home and reuse it because I've actually fixed the toaster. Let's have a look inside. There's nothing in there. Gone. We'll try to find it. Let's see how it works through the grass. This is so sketchy. This is so sketchy. Oh, I don't want to do it, Mr. Braps. Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> no, I can't. There it is! He found it! Mr. Braps with the eyes of an eagle. Got it. Nice! <laughs> That, yeah, so I've literally, fi I've not only fixed the toaster, I've also recovered a GoPro mount. Oh, I tell by the way I use my walk and my walk. Oh, man, no time to talk, and you see the light. Yeah, what? Huh? They're both road bikes. We've got the registrations right there. This road is supposed to be private, so we've just got the plates off while we take some pictures. This bit right here. Are you sure? 
All right, well, if there's a problem, we can put them on. We're just getting pictures. If there's a problem, we can put the registrations on because we're just getting pictures. Huh? Pictures. Huh? No, we're not right. We're just taking pictures. Nothing to do with you then, are they? Oh no, we don't do that. <laughs> you sure? What's that? Can you yeah. show me your registration then? Can you show me your registration? Yeah, of course. <laughs> he just look, looks at the toaster. <laughs> this isn't private road, mate. It's, it's oh, we thought this was private road right here. Yeah, it's a name road, mate. So, it's a name road. Ah, oh, right, okay. So, yeah, we must have got wrong information off the farmer. Yeah, that's what he told us. We're only going off what he said. He was going on, the reason why he said it was he's, he was going on about the fly tippers. They dump all their rubbish there and they don't get picked up. He just saw the most random bike encounter he's going to see probably this whole year. Two hours later. Mr. Brapp's telling everyone how much he loves trains. He's got like a train obsession. Currently we're stopped at a train track and there is a train which is just down there stopped. Weird. Oh, there's a train right there. <laughs> oh, yeah, it must have been for that train. Oh shit. Need some of these. That'll do. I was going to put air in my tyre, but I'm not going to. I can't be bothered. But I will shout out Lexin because they're cool. they got my... This is a portable charger and it's a pump and it's got a light on it. And it's pretty good. But first things first. Just got to sort the visor out quickly. It's got it inside your helmet. Oh, is it? <laughs> oh my God, it's Illuminati. Anyway, I was actually supposed to... Oh, I've got it all over your bike as well. I literally washed it. You've got it everywhere. Yeah, look. Yeah, cheers, mate. Clean it up for you. Thanks. Got a bit there as well. And here we are, guys, in Stamford. Where the sun shines all day, kids come out to play. Bit weird. Yeah, go back to the bike. Guys, we are dropping them in. Ah, fuck my foot. I've got a bad foot. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I've got to run like that because my foot's fucked. You know when you said to me, don't run like that when you play football, do you? No comment. Well, you can't tell by the way I use my walk. I'm a woman's man. No time at all. 